Salt Lake is one of the most efficient airports in the country and this will be a very efficient model of an airport. We're in the deepest part of the excavation, which is the terminal tunnel basement. It's 34 feet deep on the north end and 27 feet between the terminal north and the actual north edge of the parking garage. The main objective of the tunnel is the mechanical and baggage from the rack facility rental car entry into the building so you can drop your baggage off as you're dropping your rental car off and then mechanical um, chill water and hot water from the, the central energy plant. The reason you use pile is, is they call it a deep foundation and what you're doing is transferring the load of the new facility onto a layer down in the earth that can support the facility and because we're working on a obviously a lake bed there's not much good material until you get down to 60 to 70 feet below the surface. So the, the idea of a piling or a pile is that that is a structural member that goes from the bottom of foot and elevation down to that good layer of material. In general, we're driving 120 foot H pile in the, in the basement of the tunnel and they're 14 inch pile. Uh, we drive them in 60 foot lengths. We do well to splice intermittently. So we'll drive the bottoms during the day, come in and stand the tops, weld them at night, and then redrive the next day to drive the tops in. So it's a two-stage process for the depth of pile in the basement. We're working off of a cobble surface. So we've got two foot of cobble that we're walking the crane around and, on, and, and you can see the metal plates. So that stabilizes the base to where the crane can work down in the bottom. You're bringing the pile to the rig with a forklift, and then you have guys that hook up the pile plumb the leads and you have a crane operator in the crane. Uh, the hammer it, uh, it runs off diesel fuel. It fires like the piston in your car and every time it fires it raises up and it, on the return blow it's actually driving the pile. So we do pay attention to noise and we pay attention to vibration. We do have seismographs hooked up. Safety is our biggest uh, challenge. If you run a safe clean job you got great flow and efficiency and then you have great quality. So safety, quality, and schedule all go together. You get a lot of gratification, but at the end of the day, it feels great.